What's going on guys and welcome to another player review on my channel. This is going to be the third team of the season player review I'm going to be doing. It's the third of the day as well. There has been I believe four uploads today. Three actually. This is going to be the fourth. So check out those other three uploads. Uh, two of them are team of the season reviews which is uh, Brian Ruiz and Suchi. So go check them out if you haven't already. That's the centre back and the left mid you can see there. We've still got to do the other centre mid uh, or the centre mid and the right back after Funes Mori. But let's get into this Funes Mori card. It's 83 rated, 80 pace, 85 shooting, 82 dribbling there as well, 6 foot tall, medium medium work rate, right footed, 3 star weak foot, 3 star skill moves as well, and I've got him in a pack which is pretty cool, if you haven't checked out that video, that was uploaded today as well, and in the 6 games he did score 7 goals and also get 3 assists for me guys, but anyway guys, I've got a new snapchat, go check it out, it's called um, The Real MJQ. make sure to have me in snapchat at The Real MJQ, guys, but anyway, going into his in-game stats, 81 aggression, 83 acceleration, 88 agility, 93 jumping there as well, uh, 89 short pass, 89 shot power, 96 cards, 99 heading accuracy, some very very good stats there, uh, along with 77 volleys, which is a bit disappointing for a striker, but hey ho, 24 uh, is his age I suppose you could say, um, 6 foot 10, 165 pounds, and he's getting no specialities and also no traits guys, but let's get into this guys, actual clips, as you can see here, good chance early on in the first game for him, it hit the post, um, and if I had to say one thing about this card that I really enjoyed, he was one of the best finishers I've used all year. He have really improved his finishing. Um, and yeah, he's, he's honestly his quality finishing. A first, a first few of them were cheeky assists that you saw there. Um, but just like that, finishes like that. Just easy easy finishes that most strikers should finish. But he just seems to do it with complete ease. His positioning as well is completely just perfect. Everywhere you want him to be, he is. There's nothing... Um, wrong with his positioning at all, his finesse shots are incredible, just his finishing in general is very very good, as you can see picking up here again, cutting inside all the way inside, the defenders have got nowhere near me, hits that shot with power and the keeper just can't stop um, that power shot from not going in the back of the net, as you can see Flam Slamani through and goal here, great ball inside, and this is probably the best goal I scored with him, great turn inside and a lovely finesse into the far corner, um, and he was just a very very fun card to use, as you can see picking up here, turning back and then another finesse shot into the corner, his finesses were OP, his finishing in general was just absolutely incredible guys, and also his passing, the assists they made were quite good as well, but he was just a really really good, he was a good finisher, that is the kind of striker you would want to buy if you want a good finisher, maybe if you don't want somebody that's got abundance of pace, because he doesn't really have that much pace, but he fills in every other category apart from pace, he's very good at everything else and he's just a very good striker in general guys. The positive I'm going to give him are his finishing, his positioning and his passing. Um, his finishing was just insane, finished off basically everything you gave to him. His positioning always seemed to be in the right place at the right time and his passing made a few assists. Nothing wrong with the passing, it was all positive so I kind of had to put it in the positive section. And there's also going to be no negatives, there was nothing kind of standing out negatives. I could have maybe put his pace in there but I didn't feel like his pace was bad enough. Um, to be put in the negatives, I just feel like maybe if he had a bit more pace, it would be the more complete striker, that's the only thing I would say, but I guess that's not really EA's fault, that's just how he is in real life, guys, but I'm going to give him an 8.3 out of 10, that's quite a high score for me, I, no I don't normally give over 9, so um, as long as you're between 8 and 9, it means you are a really good player on this year's FIFA, guys, hopefully you have enjoyed the video, make sure to check out the latest videos, the other two player reviews, I'm going to be loads more, another two should be out in the next day or so, and then I'll be uploading more and more for your team of the season, I'm going to try and get at least 50 done during team of the season, that will include team of the week in forms and stuff as well, because they will be a lot cheaper, I'm thinking of doing the Henrik Mkhitaryan in form this week's next, um, so make sure to check out for that in the next coming days after the team of the season's one, uh, but apart from that guys, make sure to drop a like in the video, 20 likes to be insane guys subscribe as well if you're new to the channel apart from that i'll see you guys next time